The bus tab in I.O. shows buses within your Pro Tools session and can be categorized into two main usages, internal buses and buses mapped to an output. Internal buses are available to route audio within Pro Tools. This kind of bus is used to send effects within Pro Tools like reverb and delay on an aux track, or to send a range of similar tracks to a sub bus within the Pro Tools mixer. These buses can move easily with Pro Tools sessions to different systems as they are not associated with devices or physical hardware. You can use the default setting to remove extra buses that are not used in the current session. A bus that is mapped to an output has been assigned to one of the device outputs to send audio out of Pro Tools. When opening a session from somewhere else, if monitor path in the output tab is set up, Pro Tools will attempt to automatically map the buses previously assigned to the monitor path to the monitor path in your system. If you change playback engine or do not have a mapped monitor path, you may have grayed out outputs in your session or italicized type in mapping to output. Select the output in your system you monitor through in the buses tab. No other changes to the session buses or setup should be needed.